How are you? Alive. And you? Fine. Let me ask you a question. If I was to kill Miss Grimshaw, would Dutch be mad? I think, as a general rule, Dutch likes to avoid murder within the camp. I mean, it was that one time, but he was a traitor. But Miss Grimshaw, well, Dutch has a soft spot for her. I thought as much. Well, she always like this. I ain't quite old enough to know. <laughs> no, of course. So as long as you've known her? She's always liked her swill of vinegar. I'd like to give her a swig of arsenic. <laughs> we'll just do it discreetly. I will. You fancy a game of dominoes? Sure, why not? If I'm playing with you, she'll leave me alone. Can't believe the dominoes survived Blackwater, but my necklace didn't. Oh, yeah. I thought something looked different. Well, I stole that one. I'm sure I can steal another easy enough. <laughs> I'll keep my eye out for you, too. No, pass. Pass me. Okay. Yes. What is in this? Damn. Fine. Here. If the Pinkertons could see you now. Killer, bank robber, dominoes player. Well, you gotta keep them on their toes. Not the way you wanted to get arrested, though. Imagine the newspaper headlines. Well... Keep your eye out, then. Domino, I believe. Oh, God damn you! Yes! Come on, don't beat yourself up over it. We need to have some better meat. All you do is complain about Pearson's cooking. Just have be glad seat. there's food on the table. I say you deserve a rest. Who would love the people to put the food on the table? Why don't you sit and stuff? We are order up the place. a slave. He taught all the kids how to read. Huh? A good old-fashioned house nigger, they called him. But he was beaten just the same. Now, it wasn't uh, the, the master of the house who my father loved, in a way. But his brother, whom my father hated within all What do you flesh. think of the place? <laughs> I don't know. So far, it Whipping? seems okay, I guess. I think that there is rich pickings for some carpetbaggers like us. <laughs> is that what we are, is it? Avenging your father's death after pff, 30 years? There's gold, Arthur. Gold. If you say so. Okay, speak later. All right, then. His brother, the master. Javier. I heard about a house. Could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said... said it was really... freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty dubious. Of course, uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. It's up north, on the other side of the river from Valentine. This 
Sure, more or less. Let's get here. What? Okay, we're pretty close now. Let's stop and go on foot from here. Just up the hill this way. Follow me. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? Oh, big place, right? your binoculars. Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. This could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure. Look this way. Follow me. All these trees? I can't get a proper look at the place. Well, hopefully it'll make it harder for them to spot us, too. Coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. Stay low, Arthur. Maybe you would hunt a pig this time once, Mal. Creepers, bitch. Don't score notions in the Disney clinic, hey? Just stay quiet. Where you been now, new? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I was gone but ten minutes I was. You can only gag all the now day long, cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, Edie, get all the jam! You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your felt, I will. Your niece will pull it up, boy. Up. Go guard the shed. Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. What we doing, Javier? What we doing, Javier? Okay, you take cover by the rock over there. 
I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? Look what we have here. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Here, you take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Sounds good. Yeah. 